Hey everybody, James Akers here, the tie guy. I'm getting ready to show you how to tie two cool exotic knots with on one video with one tie that require the use of a push pin. So let's get started. The first one I like to call the rosebud. And they both start with the same basis. We take a tie, you want we're gonna tie the back of the tie. So we want to take the front of the tie and put the tip where we want it to be, which is about you know halfway down the belt buckle right there. And if it's a thick tie like this, we want to pull it together a little bit. Then we'll take the back of the tie over top, down, up, and through. Now we're just going to bring, uh, bring the tie up to our neck. Then we take the bottom of the back of the tie and we take the, and we tuck under the tip of it and we literally just roll it up. We're just literally rolling this up. This is one of the simplest yet coolest looking knots you will ever make. Roll all the way up here. And then once you get to the top, you turn it, you place it right here and you take your push pin and you push through the collar down into the rosebud and you have a rosebud. I'm going to post pictures on my Instagram of exactly what this looks like. There you go. Then taking the exact same basis without changing, we're going to do what we call a switchback. And again, go to my Instagram, Ty Guy James Aker, and you'll see how this comes together. The switchback knot, same concept, same basics here, but we take the, the tie and we do what I call a switchback. We fold a little bit and then we fold a little bit back and then a little bit and then we fold over and we just go back and forth all the way up the tie until we get to the top and I call this the switch back. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to tuck the pin through the collar and down through. Check out my Instagram for the pictures of guys. Hope you have a great day.